Always painting too rosy a picture, though. Well, hey there. Need something? You got some business with me? Heard you were involved in a Oh. Well, if the Marshal sent you to me, that means he's looking to recruit you. Just so you know what you're getting into. I'll explain who we are and what we do. Well, the Freestar Rangers ensure the safety and security of the Freestar Collective and its people. We might hunt down a fugitive, break up a smuggling operation, investigate a starship theft, or put some would-be bank robbers behind bars. Whatever needs doing to keep the people safe, we do. Like most things that are worth doing, it ain't always easy. But do I think we make the Freestar Collective a little safer for everyone? Yeah, I do. I imagine you've got some questions. I'll answer anything I can. Well, in theory, a Freestar Ranger can go anywhere in Freestar Collective space, uh, even private property. But of course, it doesn't always work out that way. We also have jurisdiction over any local security when we're tracking a fugitive. I'll say right up front that if you're looking to get rich, this ain't the line of work for you. But yeah, we do get paid from time to time to help with expenses and such. The number's always changing due to retirements, recruiting, and unfortunately, death in the line of duty. But as far as I know, there's never been more than a dozen rangers at any one time. Okay then, a word about myself. I'm in charge of making sure anyone that wants to be a Freestar Ranger is up to the task. That being said, the Marshal wouldn't send you here if he didn't think you had potential. So, what's it gonna be? Are you ready to sign up with the Freestar Rangers? It's a dangerous job, but an important one. As long as you leave room for your commitments to Constellation, we won't have any problems. Before I hand you a badge, I need to know you can handle the job. You helped out with the hostage situation, but sometimes people just get lucky. Tell you what, use the mission terminal and take one of the listed jobs. Your choice. Come back alive, and we'll talk about you joining up. Then I suggest you get going. A lot of famous people visit Aquila. Popping back up here.
Captain.
non-breathable app. When you have a moment, I'd like to speak to you. I have an important personal decision to make, but I need to discuss something with you first. Phew, thank you. So, where to start? Um, before I was with the Navigator Corps, I was career military, part of the United Colonies Navy. When the Colony War broke out, I was posted as the Chief Navigator on a warship, the Dauntless. Plenty. And that's what's weighing on my mind. There was a particularly bloody battle. We were fighting over a world in the Aeta Cassiopeia system. Worst fighting I'd ever seen. We lost 12 ships that day. 12. Including my own. I'm well aware how many lives were lost. Now let me finish. The ship was barely intact. The captain and first mate died the previous day, which put me in command. A shrewd captain would have called for the crew to abandon ship. But I was so angry. I wanted to stay. I needed to fight. Well, I didn't have the luxury of indecision. I had to act. We fought for hours, but the damage was fatal. I gave the order to abandon ship and the crew piled into the escape shuttle. As the shuttle launched, I could see it was damaged. I... I heard screams before the radio cut. The last thing I saw, they were... spiraling helplessly towards the planet's surface. There was... There was nothing I could do. You're sorry. For me? If I hadn't been so stubborn, so eager to prove that I could handle command, my crew would have had more time to escape. Try telling that to their loved ones. When the dust settled, the United Colonies gave me a medal. Can you believe that? A damn medal! I never even had a chance to find the shuttle wreckage and give my crew a proper burial. That's true, but still, it doesn't erase the real issue here. Remember when you said no one but me would have pushed harder to keep the Navigator Corps going? Well, this time, pushing too hard cost lives. Don't you get it? Everything I do, everything I touch, somehow falls apart. That's why I'm worried about... Us? You still have faith in me. I... don't even know what to say. I never realized how much you cared about me. I'm counting on that. Look, I think I've said all I can handle for now. Thank you for being there, for listening to me when I needed it the most. I'll never forget this. I promise.
The frames are coming soon. No time to talk. If you're looking for a sidearm, I recommend Laredo's firearm factory. I want to do your business. How about I just show?
Mayor. Oh, you're back. How'd it go? I'm always painting too rosy a picture, though. I'm sure you did. And I'm glad to know that was your priority. You did what I asked, so let's go meet the marshal. Follow me. Don't be causing trouble now. Hiya. You should try We're headquartered in the upper it floors of the Rock. The city, we also have uh, remote stations throughout Free Star Collective Space. Helps us to identify and respond to threats more quickly. Like I said before, there are less than a dozen rangers in all, and we operate with limited resources. Thankfully, most people respect us and... Ah, <sighs> always fond of high-gravity environments. This job Nothing like performing I double the effort to achieve half the efficiency. As your badge and your sidearm. Marshal. Emma! I take it you're here because you're satisfied that our new recruit can handle the job. Seems like a fine candidate got the right priorities. All right, then. Step forward, recruit. Let me have a word with you. I've got just one question. Do you pledge to defend the people of the Free Star Collective? Even if it means risking your own life? Good. Here, take these. You're now a Free Star Ranger deputy. I'm assigning you to Ranger Wilcox for some field training. Listen good to what she tells you. Welcome aboard, deputy. You've made a wise choice, but I trust that your duties as a ranger won't interfere with your service to Constellation. Wish we could throw you a welcome party, but there's work to do. We got word from a farmer on Montero Luna. She says someone's trying to take her farm, and she's afraid she might be in danger. Well, most things do at the start. Doesn't mean they stay that way. That being said, best not to assume anything. Just try to keep an open mind. Grab any supplies you might need, and let's get going. Pay attention to what Ranger Wilcox tells you. Hey there, deputy.
Free Star Rangers. You have no idea how happy I am to see you. I'm Ranger Emma Wilcox. My deputy and I are here to help. Now, tell us what happened. I was out planting in the fields when I saw some men approaching. They looked like soldiers with uniforms and weapons and such. They wanted to buy the farm. Didn't even ask if it was for sale. Their offer was so low, I told them right where they could stick it. They said they'd give me time to think about it, but if I didn't change my mind, I was gonna regret it. Then they left. Back behind the house are some canyons. They went that way. That place is dangerous. Steep slopes, narrow trails, rock slides, and all manner of hostile creatures, too. If you're going after those men, be careful. Oh, there's one other thing. They said they were the first. The first of what, I'm not sure. But there must be more of them coming. Thank you, ma'am. That should be enough for us to find these men. All right, deputy. Keep that weapon handy and your eyes sharp. Since these guys don't know we're after them, they're probably not making an effort to hide their tracks. Now, let's go and check out those canyons. Several pairs by the look. Not too old either. Let's head down into the canyon and see if we can find more. Try it on. I love it. Nice change of pace when you feel us in. Are you certain that traveling into these canyons is wise? The route looks treacherous. These canyons would have kept me busy for months. I looked into it. Any clue how irresponsible you're acting right now? Like we're heading in the right direction. You better check your ammunition supply. It's clear that we're not the only things roaming these canyons. Grab some cover!
just hope they're not perched up on these cannon walls, waiting to snipe at us. Nice to get out under the sky for a spell. Make sure you can put the spells in your back. Natural tracker. You smell that? I'd bet my badge that's wood smoke from. We should be careful. This bottleneck is the perfect place for an ambush. Wagner called in the cavalry, <laughs> except it ain't much of a cavalry. I suggest you turn around and walk away while you still can. Normally, I'd suggest you choose your words carefully so we could avoid bloodshed, but something tells me that isn't going to be possible. You think you're in a position to make demands. Well, I've got news for you. All you're getting from me is a shallow grave. So, got any last words I should try to remember? If you think I give a damn about the Free Star Rangers, then you've got no idea who you're dealing with. Matter of fact, that just makes it even more fun. Air them out, boys!
Don't leave any of that behind. That was a lot rougher than I expected. Let's talk. a lot rougher than I expected. than I expected. Let's talk. Find anything interesting? Let's see what we have here. Hmm, interesting. So, their ship was stolen from the Hope Tech factory. Whoever pulled that off must have been one hell of a shipjacker. Well, I guess someone really wants that farm bad. Speaking of which, let's get back there and let Miss Wagoner know that she's safe. For now.
Let's bring this stuff back to the ship and sort through it. What's the news? What happened? Did you find those men? Well, it's good to see you're all right then. They must have been crazy or desperate, trying to take on the Free Star Rangers. So who were they? And why do they want my farm? So I have no way of knowing if there aren't more coming. Guess I'll start sleeping with a gun nearby. I can't thank you enough. I'd hate to be remembered as the wagoner who couldn't hold on to the farm that's been in the family for so long. Of course. All the same, I'm grateful. If you have any more trouble, give us a call. We're in system, so it won't take long to get someone out here. All right, deputy. Let's get back to the rock. We need to report this to the marshal.